my help comes from Jehovah. He created heaven and earth. He spoke things to existence. God who gives life to the dead and he speaks of non-existent things as if they existed. If God created all things both visible and invisible, therefore all things need to depend on him. Do you depend on God? Is God your strength, your fortress, your hope? The Lord is faithful. He will strengthen and protect you from the evil one. No weapon fashioned against you will prosper. No demon, no witch, no wizard can stop God's divine purposes from unfolding in your life. Nobody can put a curse where God has commanded a blessing. The Bible says we are blessed with every spiritual blessing and the heavenly places in Christ Jesus. Jesus Christ is before all things in him all things consist he upholds all things by the word of his power the lord sustains me he can sustain you he gives us reason to depend on the regularity of natural order god needs to just speak the word and all things will cease to exist God promised to deliver us. God promised to watch over us. God promised to listen to us when we pray. Yes, the omnipotent, omniscient, omnipresent God, the sovereign Lord, creator of the universe, He's with us. He is in us. We better trust in Him. Let's not lean on our limited understanding. Let's have faith in God. Faith is in faith, child of God, until it's all we are holding on to. Doesn't matter what your situation or circumstances are like. Trust in God. Move at the command of His word. Walk by faith, not by sight. Take upon you higher thoughts and higher ways. Exercise faith in the midst of great trials and great triumphs will be birthed. I pray in the name of Jesus that we will exercise great faith in the midst of great tests and great testimonies will be birthed. Be God's mouthpiece. Be God's representative. Speak His word. God's word is spiritual law. It functions just as sure as natural law. God's word will produce that which God desires and inspires by that word. Yes, hold fast to the confession of the word of God. Hold fast to the absolute integrity of the Bible. Hold fast to the confession of the redemptive work of Jesus Christ. Believe that you are a new creation. You have received the life and nature of God. In the mighty name of Jesus, hold fast to the confession of the word of God, irrespective of the facts.